Hello, everybody, and welcome to uh, something new. It's gonna, well, this is not new um, in the world, but I've never done it before on my channel or in life. Um, we're gonna do a Emerald Nuzlocke. This is just a basic uh, Emerald Nuzlocke game. Nothing special about it. No, no cheats, no hacks or anything. This is obviously on an emulator. It's on my computer. Um, but we're also not gonna... I might do some grinding sessions not on camera that I'll speed up for, but as far as we're playing the game on video, we will we will just do normal speed. Um, so I've only done like a Nuzlocke sorta once up to the third gym. Then I don't think people died. I just played other video games and just forgot about it. Um, So that's the most experience I've ever had with a Nuzlocke. Emerald is my favorite Pokemon game. Best gen. Gen 3. Uh, so let's get going. We got Professor Birch. He's chilling. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch. But everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. It's a Lotan. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times as friendly playmates and at times as cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research that's what I do. And you are... I am a boy. What's my name? Uh, G... Oh, shoot. G... Scott. Enter is okay. Enter is start. Okay, or whatever. My name is G. Scott. Ah, okay, you're G. Scott who's moving to my hometown of Little Root. We're just gonna cut all myself Scott. Maybe I should have named myself Scott. <laughs> Alright, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon. Where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me when Pokemon come back. Is everyone ready for some freaking trumpets? Am I right, fellas? Literally just sitting in the back of our own moving truck. We're like, yeah, you, you don't get to sit in the front. Mom's not even in the truck, so, you know, I couldn't sit in the side. I'm just... Scott, we're here, honey. Must be tiring riding with our things in the moving truck. Well, this is Little Root Town. How do you like it? This is our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it seems to be an easy place to live, don't you think? And you get your own room, Scott. Let's go inside. See, Scott, isn't nice in here, too? The movers Pokemon do all the work of moving us in and cleaning up after. This is so convenient! Dad bought you a new clock to mark on move here. Don't forget to set it. Alright. Okay, enter is start. We said that. Uh, we will move our tech speed to fast, though. We'll also probably put battle scene off. We'll speed it up as much as we can without, you know, actually tabbing. Max speed. Nope, nope. B, B, B. Alright, let's set our clock here. The clock is stopped. Oh, wow. It was actually pretty close to what it was. Start off at 10 o'clock. It is 10 18. How do you like your new room? Good. Everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything in downstairs as well. 
Pokemon movers are so convenient. Oh, you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. I booted up the PC. I opened my notebook. Open the menu and start. Record your progress. Just save. Right, looks good, Mom. Scott, Scott, come quickly. It's Pendlebrook Gym. Maybe Dad will be on. We brought you this report in front of Pendlebrook Gym. Oh, it's over. I think Dad was on, but we missed him too bad. I guess one of Dad's friends is Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door. Go over and say hello, you freaking jerk. Wow, Mom, how dare you call me a jerk? I will do no such thing. I'm gonna go see May. I am Scott, our new next door neighbor. Hello, we have a daughter about the same age as you. She's excited about making a new friend. She's upstairs, I think. How do you think that your daughter is upstairs? It's a pretty. This. Why does no one else have a room? How come just the kids have? It would be pretty obvious if she left the house. Like. You go down the stairs and you walk across the whole room. You don't know if your daughter's upstairs. Move was I'm May. I have the stream of becoming friends with Pokemon from all the world. I heard you, but uh, Professor Birch, I was hoping that you would be nice, Scott, and that we could be friends. Oh, this is silly, isn't it? I just met you. Oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to go help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. I'll catch you later. I was supposed to go help my dad catch wild Pokemon. Well, I'm too late now. Time to play video games on my computer. <laughs> Alright, I don't care about you guys. Look at this dude! You use a PC, you can store items and Pokemon. The power of science is staggering! Dude. Uh, Professor Birch spends days in his will suddenly go out in the wild to do more research. When does he stay home? Yo, Professor Birch, what's up? I don't care what field work is. What? He's not even here? I was told to meet him in the lab. This is an outrage, I say. Hello, little girl. Um, hi, there's scary Pokemon outside. I don't have any Pokemon. Can you go see what's happening? <laughs> Help me! Hello, you over there. Please help. In my bag, there's a Pokeball. Isn't Emerald the only game where there's a Zigzagoon? I think uh, Ruby and Sapphire, it's a Puch Puchana. For some reason, they're like, yeah, we'll change it to a Zigzagoon. Alright, let's let Professor Birch die. Alright, the Zigzagoon has not devoured his soul. I guess we have. Uh, I thought about this a lot. I do like torture, but being this is a Nuzlocke, I don't want to make life harder on myself right at the beginning of the game. And everyone picks Mudkip, and no one ever gives the grass Pokemon some love, so I'm going to pick Trico. I will choose Trico as our starter. It's not hard mode Torchic, but it's also not the... Cliche Mudkip. And you know, I just, I don't know if I've ever done, started with Trico before, honestly. And all the freaking Ruby or Sapphire or Emerald games I've played. I feel like I maybe only picked Trico once. We did it. We have beat a level 2 Zigzagoon that a professor of Pokemon was helpless against. We have gained 17 XP. I was in the tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me, thanks a lot. Oh? Hi, you're G. Scott. This is not the place to chance to so come by my Pokemon lab later. So, Scott, I've heard so much about you from your dad. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon there. But the way you got early, you pulled it off with a plomb. Still know what a plomb is. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh yes, it's thanks for rescuing me. I'd like to have the Pokemon you used earlier. I received a Trico! I'll give a nickname to Trico. Something that is still similar to Trico, but with our own spin on it.
Porco. <laughs> if you work at Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also helping. And studying Pokemon will help you. Uh, no. I don't think it would be a good idea to see May. You should go meet my kid. Don't even call her your daughter, just my kid. No, I'm okay. I, I really don't want to. I already saw her. I already met her. I don't need to. I don't need to see her again. Honey, May should be happy to go get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. All right, and of course the whole uh, route catching Pokemon thing only applies once we have Pokeballs. So, you know, Pokemon we encounter in Route 101 right now do not count because we don't have Pokemon. Wild Pokemon will jump out of you in tall grass. What about you, kid? No, oh, Torco! I'm gonna pound this Puchana. I don't know what has tackled me. What if I just die? <clears throat> Shortest Nuzlocke ever. Pokemon get tired, take them to a Pokemon Center. There's one in Old Dale Town. I would like to be level 6. But I'd also not like to die. I do have to get in the mindset that this is, you know, a Nuzlocke, and, you know, if I die, I die. So, you know, don't. Ideally. I gained 23 experience and I'm level 6, baby! I learned Absorb! <laughs> Alright, we gotta heal Torko. Please. We may tab through the freaking stuff. This. <laughs> Healing our Pokemon is going to be the only thing we tab through. Speed up through. Hello, do you work at a Pokemon by chance? Oh my goodness, you do! Come with me, damn it! Look for the blue roof. We sell a variety of goods. Oh, don't give me the potion, give me Pokeballs. Saving your progress, huh? Hello, May, I heard you're up here. <clears throat> you know, I'm gonna have to go heal my Torco again. I can't be fighting May with a damaged Torco. How do we get to level 7? And then we'll fight May. I'm really nervous about the uh, May fight under the cycling road. Like already, I know that's like the toughest one. So we gotta, we gotta be prepared. Still a ways away. I'm getting ahead of myself. All right, level two. I don't know if you're gonna give me level seven, honestly, but we'll try our best. How are we going to try our best? I don't know, pounding? <laughs> this is all of this. this we could absorb, but whatever. Enough? Level 7. 15? Oh, baby, let's go! Alright, go heal. Da 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 Excuse me. I would like to rest my Pokemon. Thank you for waiting. It was hardly a wait at all. <laughs> hardly a wait at all. Man, can I get my running shoes? Oh. I, oh, level four. Goodness gracious. I'm gonna run. 
I want all 24 HP against me. What are you doing here, guy? My Pokemon is staggeringly tired. I should have bought a potion. Oh no, go go back to Old Dale Town. There's a Pokemon guy giving away a, a promotion, a free potion. A free potion promotion. No, 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 don't fight, don't fight. I know it's only level 2, and we could also absorb it. Well, it's flying. So isn't grass against uh, Wingle, wouldn't that just be normal damage, right? Super effective against water, but unaffected against flying, right? What's up, May? Oh, hi, Scott. I see my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is very like. I better warn you, May. My Torko is level 7. Is your Torchic ready to get freaking pounded? Don't scratch me, it feels damaged. Thank goodness you didn't level up your Torchic once and get a fire move. 69 XP, baby! Nice! I'm pretty good. Here's $300. I think I know why my dad has an eye out for you now. And you just got that Pokemon, but it already likes you. You might be able to befriend any kind of Pokemon easily. Well, time to head back to the lab. Give me running shoes, Mom! La 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 la. May, I see you. I can make it back on my own. You don't gotta wait. Do any of you have anything interesting to say? The PC is over there. Wireless Club is on the second floor. Pokemon Centers are great. They're free! La 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 la. Right, May. I know, girl. Damn. I've walked like two feet from my house. I know how to get back. What is this? There's a splooch on my computer. Hello, Professor Birch. I murdered your daughter's self-worth. I did beat May on my first try. That's excellent! My daughter needs to be taken down a peg. <laughs> Here, Scott, I heard this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokédex. It's a high-tech tool that autom automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you need or catch. My kid, May, goes every- Call your daughter, dude! Why is my kid- My freaking kid. Whenever my kid- catches a rare Pokemon and records its data in the Pokedex, why, May looks for me while I'm out doing field work and shows me. Oh wow, Sky, you got a Pokedex too? Ha <laughs> ha! That's great, just like me, I've got something for you too! Obtained Pokeballs! G. Scott put away the Pokeballs in the Pokeballs box. It's fun if you get a lot of Pokemon. I'm gonna look all over the place, I want different Pokemon. If I find a cute Pokemon, I'm gonna catch them with Pokeballs! Alright, let's go see what our first Pokemon is hopefully gonna be. Oh, hi, Mom. Oh, hi, Mark. I did! I got a Pokemon. I named it Torko, because I'm a millennial. <laughs> what an adorable Pokemon you got from Professor Birch. How nice. You're your father's child, alright. You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey, if you're going out on an adventure, wear these freaking running shoes. Those shoes came with instructions. Press the B button while wearing these running shoes to run extra fast. Imagine your mom gave you shoes in real life and said, press the B button to run extra fast. Like, imagine. Like, here's some shoes, honey. Here, happy birthday. Also, to make them work, press the B button while wearing them and you'll run extra fast. You'd be like, mom, are you having a stroke? Think that you have your very own Pokemon now? Your father will be overjoyed. But please be hit careful. If anything happens, come home. Go on then. Go get him, honey. 
you're gonna leave me just like dad, dude. I'm gonna be all by myself. Alright, this is it! Puchena? Wurmple! Alright! Not Puchena. We also have to not kill you. Alright, we can pound you again. Speed fell, that's fine. Oh. That felt like a little bit more than uh, the first pound did, so I was a little spooked. Alright, Wurmple! Wurmple! Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Caught. There we go. You have a nickname? Hell yeah. Uh, what do we want Wurmple's nickname to be? Uh... Flarp. Just first thing that came to mind. Flarmple. 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 Alright, that's it. Wormple, welcome to the team. Freaking level 2 jerk. This is also back in the day when, uh, you know, back in the good old day, back in my day, um, the catching a Pokemon does not give you XP. Uh, do we want to... Let's level up Wormple at least to level 3. Sorry, Flarmple. Real quick, before we go up to Route 102. Oh, that's right, I do have running shoes. Now, Poochin is the second boy. Good job, Flarmple. That's enough. <laughs> Yeah, Flarmple, that's enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> I'm gonna pound you so hard. Oh, come on, get to yellow, dude. Level 8 Twerko! Level 2 again. Flarmple, that's enough. Come back. Twerko, go. <laughs> Does Wormple, Flarmple even have, like, a move? I should check. <laughs> Alright! Yeah! I don't want to get Twerko too hyped up, though. You kill the Route 102 Pokemon and, like... the B button. Alright, Flarmple Summary. Okay, you do have Tackle, of course. Let's get you up one more, one more. Hey, look, it's your buddy. Alright, you got this, you got this. No, never mind, you don't got this. You don't got this. That's going to take ages. <laughs> I don't have the patience for that. Oh, come on. Flying ball! Level 3, baby. Twerk. All speed set. Switch him back for now, we'll we'll do a little bit more of that later. I just I just didn't want Flarmple being level two. We are doing the duplicate clause as well. I don't know if that's like a standard rule or like just some alternate rule. Um I forget if Wormples can even be in Route 102 anyway. Um But yeah. If if our first Pokemon in Route 102 is a Wormple, we'll just kill it as normal and they were only my footprints. Oh, what a dummy. 
Alright. Pokemon number two. Oh, sorry, this is Route 103. I'm such a dumb buff. Alright, we get a Zigzagoon. Oh boy. Alright. We're like the Puchena. At least that's like dark. Isn't it? Oh, we can't kill you again. We are growled. But I don't want to risk it. We'll just try to catch you. Ziggy! That's not that exciting of a nickname, but since I said it as soon as I caught it, I gotta name it Ziggy. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hey, hey, I didn't want an H. Alright, Zigzagoon, Ziggy, and Florimple. Man, all these Puchenos, just like, nah. I'm not gonna be the first Pokemon on the route. Get out of here. Alright. Level 4, 31 XP, heck yeah. Alright, one more. One more easy one. Let's look in the houses real quick. Then. Anybody got any goods? They eventually level up and become stronger. You'll be able to go farther away from here. Good. Farther away I am from home, the frickin' better, am I right, ladies? When Pokemon battle starts, the one at the left of the lift spills out. It could give you an advantage. What's my time? Alright, we'll catch one more Pokemon and then call the first video a wrap. We'll gather our quick and early team. And we're about half an hour in, so... Oh, this is Route 102. Alright, do we want to get a Pokemon up here? You could battle... No, I want to I wanna heal before the battle. I'm gonna catch a whole bunch of Pokemon. Good for you, Billy. Your name is Billy now, by the way, so... Have fun with that for the rest of your life. Oh, what's that? Your name is Jeff? Well, too bad it's Billy now. Alright. Pokemon number four! We finally get a Puchena! Well... Don't... Don't say anything too early. Oh! All right, Flarmple and Ziggy are our early team. Thank you, Torco, for hitting a critical hit. Very nice, very nice. Greatly appreciated. Yeah. Yeah. All right, and with that, what do I do? I can do saves. Save state there, and we'll also even be fancy and save in the game. Back when saving actually took four seconds. All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much. Uh, this is our first episode of the Emerald Nuzlocke. Our team at the end of episode one. A Torco, a Flarmple, and a Ziggy. And unfortunately not a Puchiena. Um, because Torco decided, hey, this would be a really good time for a critical hit. Uh, so that's it. No Pokemon for Route 102. Um, so thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy it. We'll have uh, we'll have videos out whenever they're uh, out. <laughs> um, hopefully, you know, I'll get uh, a lot of stuff done over the weekend and stuff. Uh, all that good stuff, so hopefully, you know, this will be, will, will be doing good. Uh, we'll see how my video output on YouTube goes. Alright, but anyway, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed and you want to see more, please leave a like, uh, leave a comment if you would prefer. 
and also subscribe to get notifications in your subscription box saying, hey, Gaming Scott uploaded the next video in the Emerald Nuzlocke. Uh, so thanks for watching and have a good rest of your day, and I'll see ya. Bye-bye.